What's up everyone, Agent Draven here, and we're here for another Fortnite update, which means Darth Vader boss is now on the Fortnite island. In game now, as you're in the battle bus, an Imperial ship flies past to one of the random locations, which lands with the new Darth Vader boss and a few stormtroopers. It reminds me of Chapter 2 Season 4 with the Marvel Quinjet landings. The Darth Vader ship is almost identical to these landing sites. Like, subscribe and hit the bell for all notifications. As you can see, once the ship lands, a blue beam or beacon shines up to the sky. So you know where to go if you're trying to find Darth Vader. With Darth Vader now a boss in the game, this will likely be a hot drop as he has a mythic weapon, which is the Darth Vader lightsaber. Also, the Stormtroopers have mythic E11 blaster rifles. Now let's drop in and see what we can find. And whoa, we found someone with good gaming etiquette for once, here. Seems to be friendly, seems like someone's trying to take on Darth Vader and the Stormtroopers down there. I'm just gonna watch. Oh look, no weapons, story of my life on this game. It is quite bizarre watching a burger man taking on Darth Vader, to be honest. Time to sneak in now, I think, and steal the new weapons. GG's, I almost feel bad for doing that. Now let's go and check out this new mythic lightsaber. Darth Vader lightsaber. Damage 0, whatever that means. Attack speed 0 0.57, whatever that means. Now let's check out Darth Vader and his stormtroopers up close. This is replay mode showing a landing site with Darth Vader and his two stormtroopers. As you can see, the stormtroopers seem to patrol everywhere Darth Vader goes. This is what they look like when they've been alerted to danger. What is that walk you doing, Darth Vader? So that is the main part of this Fortnite update. We got the new Darth Vader boss, his lightsaber, and the E11 blaster rifles back. We also got the new Log Jam Lotus Pure I added. If you want a closer look, check out my last video. I will link it on screen now. Also in this update, we have the Island Hopper creative missions for XP, which are collect 50 coins or get 5 melee eliminations in Ultimate Murder Mystery, collect resources in PvE1 Trigger, eliminate prop opponents in Prop Hunt Mole, unlock achievements in Color Dash, unlock achievements in Parkour Universe, and finally use vending machines in Blimp Wars, so get them done now. A like is always appreciated, subscribe if you're new around here, and follow me on Instagram at agent underscore draven. And as always, thanks for watching.